Okay guys, welcome to this video and today what are we going to be doing is making a Five Nights at Freddy's game in Unreal Engine 4. So, uh, what engine I'm using, I am using 4.20.3, I could use the newest or this one, but uh, whatever you do in here, I think it should work fine for you on this version or this version uh, well if you're working on older versions maybe something some maybe some things will be impossible to do on the engine because they aren't implemented yet so what are we going to be doing is simply five nights freddy's game uh, if you wonder what it will look like if it's going to be free roam no it's not it's going to be something like finalized too. I searched, uh, uh, I found this something like this. Um, something you can rotate, you can, you can flat, you can use flashlight, you can get cameras, and stuff like that. Uh, you, you, I think if you're a fan of Five Nights at Freddy's. You definitely saw uh, Final Nights 2 or 4 or something like that. Of course, you don't need to make cameras. But we're, in this video, we're just going to make a project and start working on it. So what we want to do is launch our Unreal Engine 4. What template are we going to go with? I, I prefer we're gonna go with third person because most of the projects are using third person and uh, well it's we have our player already created and we don't want to use the first person because uh, it has the gun and that will be pretty annoying to um, delete that gun take some time okay so now we have the third person can name this I will name this tutorial FNAF Pro project okay and create project <coughs> now what you want to know is how your finance Freddy's game will look like uh, what are the mechanics and stuff like that? What I'm gonna be showing you is the animatronics going after you and um, the cameras and making uh, everything basic like the doors and the cameras. That's what we're gonna be doing. Okay, so what we want to do first is make our character. So I personally want to want to have it like this when you're um, when I'm gonna be facing like this and press A. We're gonna be using WASD. I'm gonna rotate left, D right, W forward, and S back. But we're gonna be doing this. Of course, I uh, you can also make Q or something like that to look up or I don't know E to look down but I think WASD will do I we can make Q later on okay, yeah. so uh, first I'm gonna edit our we're gonna go to third person BP and open our third person character um, so we won't need any keypad input, VR, or movement. We won't need that. This we won't need neither. Neither this or this. So that we erase it, we can't move or do anything at all. What we want to do next is we don't want that camera room, so we're gonna attach the follow camera to the mesh and the, we're gonna delete the camera room. Uh, we want to have the camera something like this and 
we're gonna go for head. Um, do it like this. And now what we want to do is make a simple first person camera. Turn off real time. I'm gonna check if it's correct. It is correct. Now um, we don't need to uh, we don't need to make you spawn control rotation for now. You can try it, and it's less like you know it's not moving so much, which is which is I think it's pretty great. But of course, if you let let's make it like this because I don't know. It looks more like action. Okay. So, what we want to do now uh, is make the rotation. So, what we want to do is we're gonna do W, we're gonna do D first. We want to find D. Mm -hmm. Want D, and after that we want to make a timeline. Well, name it turn right. Uh, so, uh, of course, now we need to uh, make sure which uh, rotation we are facing. So right now it's zero zero zero, and that will be the base rotation. So that was will be the look forward. We're gonna make play from start. Get flow track. Make alpha. Name it alpha. But key to curve fault. This will be done zero and ball zero. Gonna make it like 0.3 and make another key should be volume one in time 0.3. Make it like this, and you can see this this raises up slower to one. Uh, what uh, we can do. can do auto so we see we just rotate like like slowly smoothly we're gonna rotate to the direction so uh, what we want to do next is get the alpha and on the updates we're gonna do s s set arc actor rotation Gonna do lerp rotator. We're gonna apply the shortest path and the alpha into the alpha. For this, we're gonna make it self. And from zero zero zero, uh, we we should what? Well, we're gonna make a simple office. Yeah, this will be the desk. We're gonna see the desk yeah, like this. On the right, there will be like, I don't know, cameras, which will be this cube. You want to rotate to the cameras. Now, what we need to do is make the rotation correct. Uh, like, so we look the same direction, direction as you want to make looking at the right. So. Like right now we are looking at this cube, which are the cameras, and, we'll, and we need to make sure that we're looking okay. So now I think this is this is okay. We're looking directly at them. So now we're gonna get the rotation. 
we're going to copy the first and paste it to B. And delete the, the, the end because it does not copy this, copy the Y, copy, copy the Z. Oh, you, you need to delete this, this ending for it. Well, it won't work. Okay, so now we press. Oh, I didn't. Okay, sorry. If we try to do the rotation back to zero, then we press D, we will slowly rotate to the cube. And that's what we really want. So we slowly rotate to the cube. Slash the canvas. Uh, and this, what you want to do, this you want to do for every, every direction. We're just gonna copy this. Um, um, we're gonna name it. We're gonna get the key A. Copy and paste it. And again, we're gonna combine. Oh, I forgot. Uh, we need to do get after rotation and plug it into the A and here too. Now uh, on the left, we want to make it look at the sphere, for example. Okay. I'm going to make it look something like this. this um, I'm not doing anything perfect I'm just making a tutorial so copy the rotation paste it here copy the Y paste it here copy, copy the Z paste it in here now let's Make the rotation zero again. I would be prepared to play. Okay. What's wrong? Yeah, yeah, I was, I, I was doing things wrong. So as I said, now we can look left and right again, and we're gonna do the same for everything else. I copy it, paste it up, W, and we're just gonna leave it empty. Zero, zero, zero. Now we can rotate from this. And last thing we want to do is the back. So that will be S. And again, we'll rotate. Well, I'm gonna just use. Oh, you can see like this, there will be a cone or something. Mm. 
Yeah, something like this. And we're gonna. We're gonna do zero, zero, and. And one and two. Okay, so now we've done the movement. You can see we've done everything is done, and that will be the end of this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And new tutor, new new next part <coughs> is coming out soon. So subscribe for more, for more tutorials and stuff like that. Goodbye.